This is clearly disturbing video which has surfaced showing Sacramento police arresting a man who refused to show them his light rail ticket. But does this video tell the whole story? There was a record check that showed some kind of notation on his parole status. Good evening. I'm Sam Shane. And I'm Christina Janes. A passerby recorded the nearly three minute video showing police wrestling the suspect to the ground and then using a stun gun once he was down. CBS 13's Angela Masalam talked with the suspect and police who both say there is much more to this story. Angela? Well, Sam, Christina, there are really two different stories here. Police say the suspect got off at this stop on 13th and then kept walking in this direction, even after police officers say they asked him to show them his ticket. But the suspect says that's not true. He says he didn't see any officers. That's 34 year old Golden Lee Smith being thrown on the ground by regional transit police, then tased and handcuffed. You can even hear Smith's girlfriend pleading with officers to stop attacking Smith. When they deboarded, they were asked to show their fare, and the male half did not show his fare and began walking away. Police Captain Norm Leong says that's what sparked the entire incident. Leong says officers followed Smith and his girlfriend and again asked to see their fares. Smith showed the officers that he and his girlfriend both had tickets, but when Smith refused, to sign a citation for delaying officers, this happened. When they went to grab his arm uh, to detain him, he, that's when he, uh, the resistance started, and then ultimately he punched one officer once and another two to three times. But Smith has a different story. We spoke to him off camera at the Sacramento County Jail Thursday. He says one of the officers tried to detain him when he refused to sign the citation, so he punched him in defense. Smith also says he didn't see the officers when he got off the train. According to Captain Leong, the officers were by the train doors checking for fares as they usually do. Do. As people deboard to get off the train, they'll ask everyone for fare to make sure that if they were on the train that they had proper fare. Sir, this is harassment. Smith claims he was just trying to go to school and says instead he was derailed for not noticing police. Help! And Captain Leong says RT is now reviewing the incident to determine whether excessive use of force was warranted. He says the officers don't wear body cameras, so investigators are now relying on surveillance from the train stations. As for Smith, he's now facing charges of battery and resisting arrest. Angela Masalam, live in Sacramento for us. Angela, thank you.